on March 2nd, you have the next big ex incident, and that's the jailhouse holocaust. So in downtown El Paso, two men are admitted into the county jail. They're both admitted for something very petty. Well, at the time that they were admitted, the prisoners were lined up because they were getting ready for their daily bath. And this is not a bath of like, let's have them be hygienic or clean. It's their delousing bath. They're delousing them in what they call a kerosene and, and vinegar bath, also their clothes. As you imagine, as these two men were admitted, one lights up a cigarette. And there's very little ventilation, so boom, the whole thing blows up. And the, the accounts are just catastrophic. I mean, you have men who are just like trying to get into the concrete walls. You have skin being, you know, the whole nine. You had one individual who ran through the courthouse during a trial on fire, leaving bloody footprints as he was, you know, burning to death. And then one gentleman makes it to the river and starts yelling out, they're killing us Mexicans, they're killing us Mexicans. This Holocaust, this news gets to Villa. And Villa is in Chihuahua, and he is supposedly vows, we're gonna to need to show the Americans what it means to light up. So a week later, he invades Columbus, New Mexico.